Okay, uh, users, welcome to the completion of Cat Ultima's Rainbow 5 Civ deck. Um, I'm gonna add these five, which is the only ones I have. Multi Civ cards. Now, I'm um, gonna go into detail before I wrap it up. Gansa, the Warrior Savage, is a fire in nature. Now, this the technical term is dual civilization, not multi. Is Civ, like I've been calling it. Same thing for whatever. I like to be technical. Um, now, um, he's a two mana creature with 400 power with no effect. He's actually a decent card. The reason he's like this is because you cannot summon him unless you have both civilizations colors in your mana zone right down here. So just keep that in mind as to why they're so broken or awesome. Sorry guys. So I'm not having a good day today. You all know Sky Sword from my previous uh, videos. So I don't need to go into detail about Sky Sword. Same thing with Estol. Same thing with Estol. So, okay. Now we're gonna go into Sandfist. Sandfist is a decent car. Um, Sandfist is a nice little card. 3 mana cost for 300 power. And it's a blocker, and he can attack. Now, what makes him good is, when he, when, if he does get discarded from your hand, if he gets discarded from your hand, and I'm gonna kill myself in 10 seconds, if this hand doesn't stop working, um, he will be put into the battle zone automatically instead of to the graveyard. That's his effect. And what we have is uh, Gallic the Shadow Warrior. Now what Gallic is known for is when he is put into the battle zone you can destroy any creature that has blocker and you will discard a card from your opponent's hand automatically. Yeah. So that's it. These are going into the deck. They will be a nice addition. Because they have a civilization for a wall. Corresponding. And here it is. Okay, um let me adjust. Okay, well, um, now uh, I'm going to leave with you some final thoughts. Uh, first of all, thank you for watching and put putting up with seeing nothing but my hands. Reminded me of doing Mr. Bill. Okay, uh, I forgot know what that is. Or Pizza Head. Pizza Head. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, it reminded me of doing that with all my hands and whatever. It was actually kind of fun uh, to do this. I love Duel Masters. Uh, I don't know, I just love it. Um, I don't care what age you are, if you want a nice clean TCG that's still selling. It's not expensive and whatever. This is it. <laughs> and, you know, if you don't want to invest, play online. Uh, there's two great places to go to. Dualzone.org uh, D-U-E-L-Z-O-N-E dot O-R-G they specialize in the traditional English and Japanese um, games. The English, the English version is played on a program called DMC, um, and the Japanese version is hosted by a site called KiriCorp on a pro on a little um, Java-based uh, program they call um, Kaijudo Portal. Uh, and the next is if you want. A style of dual masters that does not have all the brokenness as the English and Japanese have. Some of the cards are actually modified and it's actually pretty fun to play. Uh, head to uh, kiricorp.net, K I R R I C O R P.net. Uh, if I have it wrong, the links will be in the uh, right hand column. Um, so let me think what else am I going to say about this. Head over there, uh, 
they are they are the hosts of uh Kajiro Portal. Um so yeah, as you see they're sharing their site with um dualzone.org for the Japanese play. But there's also um Kiri Corp's version of it. Now not a lot of the cards are added, it's just the broken ones that make the game more skillful. And there's a forty card deck limit and uh when you play by the well they call it cape uh Kajuto portal rules. So when you play by Kajuto Portal rules you're restricted to forty cards. So head over to KiriCorp.net and uh check it out. It's a nice self fun experience. Same thing with Dual Zone. A lot of nice people. You got some youngsters, so keep your mouth uh, typing clean. And got some oldies, so show respect. Uh yeah, just a fair warning from uh Chaotic Ultima, aka Skivazoa and Kagome on the um Dual Zone and Kiri Corp uh chat rooms. So, um this is uh, Chaotic Ultima. I'm out. Thank you very much for um, watching, and I will be posting more decks and hopefully duels in the coming future. Now, I plan on uh, really trying to bring this game back to life. Wizards was very stupid to get rid of it. I shouldn't say stupid, but whatever. They weren't very wise. They had a good thing. But they invested so much time into MTG, it's just so... Oh, yes. I'm not knocking MTG, I love Magic the Gathering, but um... It's one of those games that you had to have been playing from the get-go to actually get used to it. Duel Masters is somewhat like that, but it's not. Uh, if you don't know what Duel Masters is, go to DuelZone.org, go to KiriCard, they'll tell you what it is. They'll teach you everything you need to know. I'll even be posting videos on uh, how to start playing. So, um, that's it. Okay, I have Ultima. Ow.